Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Fears the, 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 the Fears to Fathom. There you go. Fears to Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survived. You are playing episode one. More episodes are coming soon. First story. Home Alone. Oh, so are these like based on real life stories? Let's do this. July 12th. I didn't want to put this up on Reddit just for it to be called a piece of fiction. I don't even know where to start. Excuse my lack of good storytelling skills. <laughs> no, wait, did this happen to real people? I guess I'll just start. It was the middle of the summer. My parents had left for that weekend due to a work trip. Which meant I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I have... I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. I would sleep and get up just about any time of the day. So I did plan on fixing that. Well, just fall asleep at night. Then. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, hang on. Messages. Um, you need anything. Make sure you check. It's them at the door before opening it. Check through the blinds. Take it, honey. Sure thing, Mum. Dad and I may be back Sunday evening. Why are you being so paranoid? Mum, 14. I think I'm going to take a nap. Probably going to order some pizza. Yes. Can I close that one now? There we go. How's Ken? Yeah, crap. Totally forgot. Probably do it tonight. Lol, same. Oh, this is the Mason. My parents are out for the, the night. Want to come over? We can play Mario Kart 2. I'll let you know. Okay, call cool, Josh 2. I can't promise. Oh. Okay. Hang on. Let me start all that again. Let me start all, all, all that again. Wait. When are you guys going to be back? Dad and I are going to be back on Monday, honey. Didn't I tell you that yesterday? Cool. Take care, honey. Sleep on time. I promise. I'll... I hope you... I hope you'll get the Xbox like you promised. Read the chats. I mean, if you get that discount... Can I invite Mason and Josh over for the night for homework? Of course you can. Call me if you need anything. Make, make sure you check. Well, make sure to check it's them on the door before opening it. Check through the blinds. Take care, honey. Sure thing, mum. Dad and I may be back by Sunday evening. Why are you so? Why are you being so paranoid, mum? I'm fourteen. I'm think I'm gonna take a little nap. Probably order some pizza. Yes. Then to Mason. Yo, yo. You coming to Jessica's tomorrow? Yeah, her Josh is coming too. What about you? I don't know. What's wrong? Weren't you going to see her yesterday? She didn't show up. It's like I don't even matter to her. You matter. Unless you multiply yourself by the speed of light squared, then your energy... I guess I'm energy then. How's Cam? Yeah, crap. I'm totally probably going to do it tonight. Lol, same. My parents are out for the night. Want to come over? We can play Mario Kart too. I'll let you know. Okay, call Josh. I can't promise, dude. May have plans with Nat. I wake up around 8 after a nap that evening. Space to wake up. Wait. Uh, wait. Can, what's happening? Can I hear myself? No, okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Can I have a look around? Radio. Nice. 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 Why are you waking up so late? What's happening outside here? Nothing. Bang. You open that door with fucking force. Mum, three text messages. No need to order anything. I already made you lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. Oh, yes, mum, you're the best. Is that my house? That's a lot. Don't ask me why, but I went straight to my parents' room. Sir? Sir? See the crash. No one's here, okay. Bro, I hear car doors and shit going.
Can I just express? This is my brain all the time. I don't blame you. Oh. Food was cold. Okay, well, yeah. Have you got a microwave to put it in? Oh, you can chuck it in the oven. Yep, food was hitting it. I get it. It went ding! It's nice and hot. I like watching TV while I eat. Let's go watch some TV, shall we? Wherever the TV is. TV's right here. Let's turn this bad boy on. Let's, let's sit in this chair right here. What are we watching here? Nom! Lasagna! Nom! Lasagna! Nom! Lasagna. Someone just walked upstairs. I was already feeling sleepy after eating. No. no, 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 no. Let's get up. I'm gonna throw this at the man that just walked upstairs. Mason Oliver, hang on. Stop. We're gonna have to call it off, man. Just come up. You gotta come to Jessica's tomorrow. Bro, I don't think you're going to Jessica's tomorrow. Get ready. Throw it at someone. Ombre? I'm sorry, Miles. I gotta see you tomorrow. Okay. Miles? Get ready to throw. Where's that fucking door? Okay, Miles, you're gonna put that on there. I, I had homework before going to bed. Okay, cool. I couldn't focus because it's the TV's noise down. The TV was. Take him, take him, take him my pan again. Take my pen again. I'm done. Right, dead night. Miles, you're good. You're good. You got your your, your lasagna pen. You can just slap a bitch. You're fine. Gucci, Gucci, go. Just in case. Just in case. You gotta, you gotta have the lasagna, the lasagna pen there. All right. We about the Garfield this bitch up. Twelve thirty eight AM No my homie My me hombre I got done with the homework for the day in about a few hours. Damn yeah, my boy put the he put the work in Mum two messages a AM Don't say up too late you kids I shouldn't get to hear from Mrs. Polo this time yeah, well, go to sleep son One sixteen AM. I got up to get some water. Grab your fucking lasagna pan.
You're about to fuck someone's die up. Is what is about to happen? Okay, put put the put the pen down. Grab the lasagna pan. I understand you ate the whole lasagna pan. Fuck. So you did. And then you went all the way back to bed. We're adding we're adding a bit of flavour to the good story. Oh, oh, mum, mum sent an image. Um, who the fuck? Enter. No, mums, oh, mums. Hola. Paul sent me, said he's going to be creeping through the window. We're calling the cops. Do not answer the door. No matter what he does. Well, what if I just keep, keep my eye on him? Fuck it, answer the door. See what happens. Boom. I'm the boogeyman. I've got my lasagna tray. Click the hide. I, I should silence my phone. No, no. No, mames, do not enter the fucking door. Do not. Miles. Let's pull out the door. No, it's not. Who is he? Do you hear it? It's pull out the door. Mum, so sorry, honey. No, 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 can you send me photo proof, please? Um, photo proof. I've got my pen. Got my lasagna pen. No thanks. Paula, shut up. <laughs> Paula, shut up. That, that, that just crashed on me. Fuck. Don't answer the door, no matter what he does. Well, when you tell me that Polar's...
I am good. I'm good. I'm good. Click the hide. Okay. And then apparently. Until the police arrive. Okay, so what? We just sit here now. You ring that bell as long as you want, Polly. I'm not getting up. No, fuck off. Okay. I couldn't even survive through the first fucking episode. A game by... Oh, Paula! Paula, he touched me in so many places! Oh, there we go. We get out of it like that. I get out of it. Ourself, okay. Number two. 